Hi beauties, Liv here. So I know with the party season uh, almost upon us, uh, we all like to really look our best. I know that I sometimes call on the help of hair extensions to kind of make my hair look a little bit fuller um, and a little bit more voluminous um, and help me to create sometimes styles that I think my hair wouldn't be up to without um, a little bit of help from some extensions. Um, and one thing that I have always battled with since I've become balayage, and I'm sure the other two-tone girls out there probably um, suffer with the same thing, is that I never know whether to go for kind of blonde or brunette extensions um, because you kind of want the hair to mix in with the bottom length, but also you don't want them to be too different from the colour that you've got at your roots. So what's a girl to do? Um, thankfully, Headlines hair extensions have... Um, have come to the rescue, Headlines Hair Pieces, and they have come out with some brilliant balayage two-tone extensions. So you kind of don't have to worry about um, the hair that you clip into your hair sticking out um, or looking funny or looking really obvious and really fake. Uh, so I thought in the spirit of these new extensions as a way of celebrating them, I would show you how I apply them for a couple of different hair looks that I love. So firstly there's just your kind of straight um, out sleek sort of look. Uh, you can. The great thing about these hair extensions is that they're 100% real hair so you can wash them, blow dry them, straighten them, curl them, do whatever you want to do. Whatever you do to your normal hair you can do to these. They are completely durable and they will last you a very 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 long time. Um, just make sure you use you know good quality products, good quality shampoo and conditioner um, and nice brushes uh, and keep them really tangle free and lovely. Um, so I'm going to just show you how I put them in if I'm wearing my hair out like this. So I kind of part my hair normally just above the crown, like that, and just tie the top up with a hair elastic. Sometimes you can use a comb to make sure you've got a really sleek line at the back here, but I mean I do this quite a lot so I'm not that bothered. I then take my clips like this and just make sure they're unclipped and they're sleek. Now you're going to clip into the hair like that. Um, if you've got quite slippery hair or really straight hair, it's probably a good idea to back comb a little bit um, just near the roots here, just so that their clips have something to grab onto. But my hair, it's a little bit dirty at the moment, they'll probably clip in just fine. So I'll show you, I'll try and show you from the back here. Straight in like that. So you can see they just sit like that, they sit really flat. Um, and when I put my hair down, they're completely undetectable. So I wore these on the weekend and everybody was really shocked um, when I told them I was wearing hair extensions because they blended in so well to my natural hair, which is something that's really important because you don't want them to look obvious or fake um, or like you've just whacked a whole heap of um, unmatching hair extensions in there. It just doesn't look very nice. So these are really, really effective um, for us two-toned girls. The second look I love when I'm going out at night is having a bit of a high ponytail. I think it looks really sleek and really lovely um, with a pop of colour on the lips um, and a nice dress and some high heels. So how I go about this is a little bit different. I did find that when I used to pin my extensions in how I just showed you um, and then tied it up into a high ponytail, the clips were bending up the wrong way and kind of seemed really obvious in my hair. So to combat that, I came up with the, a solution. Now that is, instead of clipping the clips downward like this, I was gonna clip them in the direction the hair was going. So if I was clipping them there and then pulling it up into a ponytail, I now clip them up this way so that they're going up into a ponytail, they're being scooped up and they're not having to bend the wrong way in order to flow into the perfect ponytail. So I'll show you how I do that. It's similar to how I showed you before. You pull the top section of your hair up and tie it up temporarily. I then grab my extension and I'm going to clip them up the wrong way around. So you can see they're hanging the wrong way out. Probably looks a little bit silly. But when you go to scoop your hair up into a ponytail like I'm about to show you, it works really well. So there you go, there's my high ponytail. 
not a clip in sight and my hair looks a little bit fuller and a little bit nicer I think for evening so I'm very very happy. Um, there you go beauties, headlines, perfect. I could not live without them this party season and I doubt you'll be able to either. Bye.